So it's pretty well documented that the one thing you don't want to do in a game of Pokemon Unite is to use your Unite move in between about 310 and 2 minutes, you know. You want to save that last Unite move for the Zapdos fight because that's the most important fight of the game. That's the fight that makes or breaks the game as you're about to see in this clip. And unfortunately my clip only goes this far back. But you can see Wigglytuff using his Unite move at 202. We'll talk about that later. But you can't do that. And you, we're going to show why this, this misplay lost in the game. But it lost in the game in such a unique fashion that I had to make this video on it and kind of break it down. Because I wanted to break this down. Because I think I played out of my mind at this particular moment. But yeah, they're pushing at 201. Look, their Delphox is going to be dead before Zapdos. Broken ass fire spin. Not there for the Zapdos fight. Wigglytuff won't have his Unite move, which is one of the better ones in the game for this fight. Especially because I'm playing the big T, T Serena. I can't, I, I can grab whoever I want now because I don't have to worry about him, you know, putting the shield up for people once, once I get to that fight. So, yeah, it's just a very, very bad choke. And this is why you don't push at two minutes, folks. And if you do, like, you're either going to die for it. Or you're going to have to use your Unite move to get out of there. And the latter is what happened. Wigglytuff uses his. Delphox died. Actually, both happened. Like, bro. But yeah, man. This is this is the breakdown. Why you can't you can't push like this. Don't push at two minutes. Push P or something. Because let's just get into it, folks. So, they do the worst push of all time. He has to use his Unite at 202. And look at that, we're down by a dub. They were up by so much. Why were they pushing like that? But I'm saying, okay, family, we get Zapdos, we can do this. But look at this. They have Bunny on Zapdos alone. So this is real life the easiest play I've ever gotten. I got the Queenly Majesty set up. I'm playing on solo, so I can't really, you know, I haven't been too fond of my teammates' play throughout this entire game, you know, considering we're down by so much. The top goal is gone. They still have bot goal, you know, we're just... We're just in a deficit. Our Pikachu just died to Greedon for no reason. Look, look where he died Greedon at on the map, bro. But this is the very... This is the turning point. I don't know why their bunny decided to start Zap. They just come in, defend it pretty well. Oh, wait, they can't do that because a certain Wigglytuff uses Unite move at 202. So now I have the easiest... Look, this is a Trop Kick to get the dash. Another Trop Kick with the Queenly Majesty. And now I have the shield on it. And it's literally the most... the easiest freest pull up unite move and i have my stacks so it's doing half roll the clip there's no wiggly unite there's no delphox fire spin because it died i like i said the stacks that's half of your health you got flame charge full heal on the sing when wiggly tough comes back and like look at that pikachu hits him with the unite move that's a triple stomp they're getting wrecked three stomps for a three kill streak folks like I don't know what to say, but it doesn't stop there. We got three out of here. The Delphox is back. As you can see, Snorlax playing the defense on that. You know, it's not really a threat to get in past that, especially with Snorlax there and with the big T. So that Mon's really not even in commission with broken ass fire spin because Snorlax just absorbs it and has block. But uh, let's just continue. And it's still prime time. The carry is out of here. One of the mages is out of here. And Wigglytuff is out of here. We gotta worry about that meddling ass Greedon. Zapdos is mad low. Greedon's trying to steal some shit. He got Desi out of here, but I got him out of here. And like that, th now we get Zap. Their team's respawning, but too late. Too late. I mean, we got Zap. I took three out. I had to make sure Greedon didn't try some shit. He didn't even have Belch. It wasn't even Belch Greedon, so... It that lowered his chances of out-securing Stomp already, but... Yeah, man. Got him with the... Got Greedon out of here just for good measure. And got the last hit on Zapdos. But trust me, we're not done yet. We're somehow not done yet. And we send it off with a big fuck you to Delphox. We score on Zapdos. We defend. We win. That's gonna do it. Pretty much, I mean... Five KOs at Zapdos. And secure Zapdos. I mean... There has to be like, I guess the game didn't consider it a five kill streak, but you guys saw it. Come on now. But um, yeah, moral of the story is don't use your Unite move at 202 with Wigglytuff when the other team has a big T that can do half of the damage to your carry Pokemon. 
that's all I got to say, really. And also don't push at 202 because between three minutes to two minutes, I'm just attacking wild Pokemon. If I don't have my Unite move, I'm farming it back up. And if I do have it, I'm not using it and I'm not pushing and doing something that would get me in a position where I want to use it to survive because that'll happen. You see, it that, that, that happened. I mean, it, I don't know what else to say, really. Just, uh... You know, a late push wasn't worth it. They had a big-ass lead, too. But, uh... There has to be an, a term for if you get all five KOs, whether or not it's a streak. Like, you know, they cut my streak off because, you know, they didn't want me to eat. But you do that and get zapped, it's gonna be an aim for it. I don't even know if I scored my points. Because I did a lot of games like this where I just went absolutely ballistic at Zapdos around the days of this game. And some of them I scored with Zap, some of them I didn't. So I don't even remember if I scored, but I'm, I actually think I didn't. I think I screenshotted the Unite DB or Unite API uh, results screen. And then I didn't... What am I trying to say? I didn't... Uh, damn, I really don't remember. I didn't score. Because I had the confirmation, but we did in fact win after scoring our, ours at those points. The rest of our team did. And that's all that matters. The W. I'm pretty sure I, I think I actually might have scored. I really don't remember, but I definitely think I still MVP'd carrying these cats. Because, I mean, what else can I say? We, we, you saw the clip. You, you guys saw it. <laughs>